What's going on everybody? So I'm back in the video and today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to spoof your location on your iOS 14 jailbroken device using the Cydia tweet called Reborn. So before I show you guys how to get it and show you guys how it works, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys never miss a video. So the first thing you guys want to do is obviously open up Cydia. Once you guys have Cydia opened up, head to the source tab. And then you want to add the source down below in the description of the video. Just tap on edit and then add. And then you want to add this source right here. D-A-K-U-S-U-T-A 777.github.io slash repo. Just like that. It's going to be in the description so you guys can just copy and paste it in. So once you have added that repo, we can head to the search tab and you want to search for a tweet called relocate. So make sure you guys download, um, download it from the repo that I showed you guys. Click on modify and then install it onto your device. So I already have it installed, so I don't need to install it again. So once you guys have installed the tweak, we can go to the settings application right here. And you're obviously going to want to look for the relocate tweak. And some of you guys, obviously, if you don't have this shuffle tweak installed, you'll have to scroll down and find it. But mine's under tweaks and then relocate. So I did want to mention this does not work in the official uh, Google Maps application that comes with your iOS device. Um, it used to work, but now it doesn't work at all anymore, but it does work in Snapchat, which I'm going to show you guys in this video. So the first thing you guys obviously want to do is toggle it on. And then there is a global override, which is going to enable it for all applications, or you can enable it in specific apps. So I'm just going to do it in the global override right here. So we're going to toggle that on and you have a no GPS mode, favorite manager system services, and then um, if you want to restore the default settings, you guys can do that as well. So what I'm doing is going into the global override, but if you want it in specific applications only, then you can go to this one right here, the second one where it says application override. So you can go to location, and then from here, it's going to give you um, the map of the world. You guys can select anywhere. So obviously, this is not my current location, um, but we can spoof to whatever location we want. So for example, if I want to go to... Japan will do that. So if you want to select a location, just tap and hold. So tap and hold. And there you guys have it. And then you're done. Click on save. And then I'm going to show you guys in Snapchat that it's actually spoofed my location. So if I go into Snapchat real quick, you guys will see if I open up my map right here, it's going to show that I am currently in Japan or wherever I put the location at. So I'm going to show you guys right now, if I go into Snapchat, you guys are going to be able to see if I go to the map that I'm currently in Japan. This is where I put the location at. So I don't recommend spoofing locations over and over um, from like app to app. For example, for Snapchat, especially you can get banned from spoofing. Um, so I wouldn't recommend doing it like going from like Australia to the US and then to like Russia. So only do this a couple of times a day if you're really trying to do it, but it's still pretty cool how you guys can do it. But like I said, it does not work in the uh, official Google Maps application. So what I did want to test in this video, which I don't 100% know if it works, is Pokemon Go. So fortunately I can't test it out just because I did forget that um, Pokemon Go does not work on a jailbroken device and there's no bypass as of right now. I tried kernel bypass that doesn't work for me but if you guys know a bypass for pokemon go let me know down below in the comment section i'll be sure to make a video on that asap but it should work in other applications as well if you're trying to use it like a messenger or wherever else but if you guys did enjoy this video make sure you guys drop a like on it hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys never miss a video i also want to thank you guys for 800 subscribers we're already almost at a thousand subscribers and i believe like three days ago i was only at like to 300 subscribers so i really appreciate the support on the channel tons of videos on the way i'm gonna also have a top 10 c video tomorrow so stay tuned for that and yeah guys basically it and i'll see you guys in the next one